All right, what's up guys? And of course, always welcome back to another video from yours truly, The Scarander. Now, I have been thinking for a long time and this is something that since, of course, Auras really was a thing, I was just thinking, you know, what if these remakes all always leveled up, like always took the next step, and I was always exciting about, excited about remakes because I knew they were giving me something else. Now, I don't necessarily feel that way at all. I think Pokemon Let's Go was my first real letdown. Uh, so much so that I actually didn't complete the game because I felt I felt cheated. I honestly did. And take that in contrast with actually playing um, Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. And while it's something I do upload still, I also feel very cheated. So much so that I really can't help feeling that my nostalgia is um, what's paying these things to keep coming back and it's it's kind of disturbing the more I think about it because I do recognize that while these games nostalgic and good um, or good for their time they haven't been translated all that well to modern consoles and I can't help feeling that it will keep remaining being just so. Um, and Black and White is a series of games that I hold very dearly as it is my reintroduction to Pokemon. And short or long story short, I stopped playing Pokemon after Ruby and Sapphire. I never played Emerald, never played a Diamond and, sh and you know, Pearl and Platinum till this year actually. Um, because I had a lot of minds, I was training a lot and you know you know I was a kid so I, I dropped Pokemon Pokemon was simply not cool like it is now but <laughs> but still it's something that actually made me come back was that I really like uh, Reshiram and Sekram I like the Digimon ish uh, monster was introduced so much so that I actually got myself a fucking Sekram like yeah I got this McDonald's I actually went for a happy meal to get this guy that's how much i like him that also means that this video becomes all the more scarier to think about in the near future because it also means that if if the console remake is going to be treated as poorly as you know the titles has been as of now i don't want them to ruin my magic i go so far and say that it's a good enough reason to never buy them in the first place and I don't want to feel that way because I think Auras and even Heart Gold and Soul Silver actually made the titles for me a lot. Like I like the titles more because they were revamped to you know the modern consoles and modern uh, aesthetics and you know all of that jazz. It 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 made the game new again. I think the the concept of the game was still there, but it took it you know to the next level and they enhanced it. And when they actively decided never to do that, let's go. I thought that was fine, like you know, bare bones, um, red and <laughs> red and blue, fine, right? But when they did the same with, or actually didn't do it because they actually Mel Metal and the Lowland forms were in the game. Uh, but when they took the step with Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl, of never actually taking that step, that's where I started to get worried because all of a sudden, dust. No, but. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> but all of a sudden these games were already as old as its original title. There was really no point besides a cheaper game, I guess, to play the game or to replay an older game. And if that's the route we're taking for these future titles, I, I simply don't want to be a part of that. And even more so, if they make strip the game even harder with bare bones after meta it was at the time, con contrasting with what um, removed the team's function. I, there is a lot of things at stake here that I just scares me. One thing to mention in my Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl that would make the game better is that, and I really can't stress this enough, if they want to have a faithful remake, they should make everything faithful. They should reintroduce the TMs, maybe the type-ins, and, you know, make it faithful. Instead, it seems to be very selective and uh, if it is a design choice to not just make it better, then, then why make it in the first place? For, for, uh, fuck! I'm sorry. <laughs> like, if I ex go into experience a black and white with barebone content, 
I just don't want to be a part of that. I, I simply can't accept that. <laughs> I simply cannot. And, and then, like I said, it bothers me on a fundamental level so much. Um, how do you guys even feel about that? Because I feel there was an active choice of you know, not make the games as great as possible. I and I get that. Uh, <laughs> I don't, but I understand like the, the business model about it. Um, but when it seems so actively you know, decided not to make it next gen besides the graphic, then I, I simply can't accept that. Um, there are so many great remakes that are made, and I feel like modern games do not treat this game as well as the predecessors. Um, there are a lot of old RPGs that got revamped and redefined, and then you see the bare bones one, and I was pretty sure Pokemon was never going to be a part of that. I, I'm like Squaresoft or Square Enix did that, and I was kind of yeah, I expect that. Pokemon do not stand for quality, but when they lower their quality, it becomes worse. Like, how could you possibly get worse? <laughs> I guess, I guess, like that's a bad bet. They can. Hey, let's let's try, let's try not to do anything and see what happens. They might sell it anyway, and it did. Um, so yeah, I personally, if they're gonna treat um, red and blue the same or. <laughs> The black and white the same way as they did the brilliant diamond and shining pearl and pokemon let's go yeah i don't want it i i don't want them to ruin the magic i don't want them to take this guy which like i said is a personal favorite of mine to simply vanish like i am not a nerd i tell myself that still i got this but it actually is something that is bothering me and you know it's the generation where this guy made an entry and became a mascot for me the fourth, and even at that, yeah, like I said, I don't want it. I, I want this to be still good, and if they can't bring that to me, then I'm being maybe a bit entitled. But honestly, why ruin something so good? Why, why make a remake if you don't have a purpose of rebranding it and make it look next gen for fit? For you know the generations you transpire and yes I want black and white to be a gen 9 title if they decide to take that route and if they don't do it I don't want it I said it so many times now shut up already <laughs> okay as always thank you for watching hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you guys in the next video until then take care right bye